Hey, is it working? Is the audio okay? I just waited a few seconds because it always cuts um, like a little bit of the intro. So, welcome to New Content Monday. I'm at the store, you know, as always, and I was super bored and I already did everything that I had to do. Today I already did my French class on Duolingo, I already read Hamlet, I already uploaded a TikTok, and I already fed my poo, and what else? I pretty much did everything that I had to do, so I was like, oh, I want to get distracted, so I was like, I'm totally going to record a new YouTube video, because... I want to distract myself. Yeah, I already told you. So, this video is going to be very scary to me because we're going to read my diary. I have this diary for, I mean, I've had it since January 4th, 2021. <laughs> and I, it really helped me understand how I was feeling often because I don't actually, I don't know. So we're going to read it and it made me realize how many of the stuff that I wanted I got and that's very cool. So January 4th. We finally got home from the New Year's camp. I got really happy because that was the first time of the year that I spent home. So I got a little early and started cleaning everything up. Okay, my room just got painted. <laughs> That's so cool. It's beautiful. I installed my old LED lights and so I could start my workout. I did three workout videos. That's so... No, this is gonna make me feel bad. This is gonna make me feel bad. Because I honestly, um, emotionally, emotionally, I'm so much better. But I just don't know. I, I only worked out. That's how I got distracted back then, last year. So... Next day, um, played volleyball with my brother. That's so funny. Okay, there's some really deep shit in here, so. Oh my god, this. Time is running so fast. It's been five days already. I mean, from January, I was talking about that. I miss training. I am freaking. I'm totally nervous. I don't sing anymore. I'm missing my old life, but I wouldn't want to lose everything I've learned this time. Just to have it all back together. I want to be a genius, but I'm just so fucking lazy. I need to do more relevant stuff. I don't want to keep living this life like this. I mean, I was—I didn't actually... I mean, I'm obviously gonna keep living, but I just won't like it if I don't... Um, really get back on my career track. So... <laughs> it's very funny. Because it's, it's like, it goes from one topic to another so fucking fast. And my mood. My, I, I never had a sad week. I only had like a sad night and then the next morning is completely opposite. I'm extremely happy. So, January 7th. We had a meeting and we talked about going to Brazil. We got, hope we got a lot of money these days. We have a lot to do tomorrow. Yesterday was so depressing, laughing my ass off. <laughs> so, I'm feeling better today. I cried all my tears last night. 
LOL. So, there's something here. Mm. Well, January 10th. Okay, January 10th. Fuck my passport because I wanted to really get my passport done so I could like have it ready for when I go to the US. But I just never, I never got to do that. And I was so willing to, but then it got postponed because we went to Brazil. I feel good. I kind of want to get to work already. I am really, I'm really grateful for this. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, and this is so sad because I was very sad in Brazil as well. I don't know why. It, I mean, it wasn't because of somebody. It was just because of my disappointment in myself. I never get sad because of someone else. I only get sad because of my life. So, um, oh, this is so cute because I used to manifest so much, like so much. I used to manifest every fucking thing. And look at this cute drawing. I was so adorable. I was literally so adorable. Okay, it's New York in winter is beautiful. The streets are slippery though. I don't want to mess up my Chanel. <laughs> I still have a lot to show. I am the best of all. I am the most complete person. Okay, and this one's so funny. January 28th, 2021. No one gives a fuck about your fucking law career. I literally heard you mumbling about it for 30 minutes about your semester. And when I have to... <laughs> Well, it's literally just me venting. Okay, this is T. Honestly, I need somebody who supports me when I'm in doubt. I just need to do it. But I'm not enough alone yet. I'd rather hate my life in the US than hate my life in this place. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay, dude, okay. But I don't, I don't. I don't want to tell you everything. I don't want to tell you everything that I put here. So let's do a little one of these. Random day. Random day. Decided I'm going back to study. I'm so excited to work my body again. I hope I get a bunch of encouragement because it's sort of embarrassing. I decided to go back to my school, but then, like, a month later, I dropped out again. Let's see. Oh my god. <sighs> okay, May 20th, I'm getting my, nurse, my nose pierced tomorrow. I quit at school again. I started my own business, which is over, but that was fun. I started working on exercising. I bought a new phone. My phone. Okay. The noodles com commercial aired. I was in a noodles commercial. That's how I bought my phone. Started doing TikToks again. I'm so proud of myself. I have tea and fruits for breakfast now. Yo, this was the start of... <laughs> anyway, I only drink coffee twice a week. I don't drink any Coke anymore. Been painting CDs lately. <laughs> That's so cute. Friday, May 28th. Um, started my business. Today I got the BTS meal. 
My piercing is healing. Our little cat died. Oh! Oh my god, I just forgot about that. I don't exercise anymore. That's cool. And I bought I bought three new sweaters. That's so crazy. This is probably boring, but if you really are nosy about my life, you're eating today. June 8th. Life sucks. And what if what if I'm being ungrateful? I don't give a fuck. I don't have to adapt my life to others. This is my perspective and I hate it here. And I'm in this plan to go full world domination or else nothing. I'm being so dramatic. I'm just so fucking mad to myself right now. I'm 20 years old and I don't know what the fuck. I don't know who the fuck I am. And there are some little kids out there that know their shit like they're the man. Uh oh. Oh no. Let's just slap it off because I don't wanna. I already. Look at this shit. What the hell? Okay, July 2021. Woke up with an attitude. A bad attitude. My dad noticed me shockingly and decided to give me a question. Are you happy? Which I promised myself a while ago that I wouldn't like whenever someone asked me that. So I didn't respond to him. And he made a whole life speech about happiness, said a bunch of stuff that I didn't want to hear, but I needed to, I guess. It really hurt me because they were all true. He left me at the store and then I bawled my ass out like I never did before. I let it all out and had breakfast. <laughs> the fact that I had breakfast <laughs> after my breakdown. Surprisingly, Dad knew exactly the problem. He said, and I quote, "No, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna tell you everything. I'm not gonna tell you everything. Oh, fuck this. August seventh. A random girl on Twitter bought me the Red Taylor's version CD." I just hope she already ordered it and doesn't forget about it. It feels surreal because the album comes out in November. That was bullshit. Anyway. August 13th. Got my second vaccine. I feel... <laughs> oh my god, my sister bought me the happiest happier than ever CD. I was so surprised about her choice, but you know what? It's a sign of the beginning of my healing era. Kind of true. And I did this yesterday. I finally got back on track on writing my diary, which is cool. But I just really enjoy making videos instead of just writing, you know? Because I don't like my, my letters. I don't like, uh, I mean, I don't know. And I, I want to decorate it. I really want to decorate it. I saw this girl on TikTok that really had the most beautiful diaries and she had five of these and they were all decorated with collage of their beautiful people like their idols I and mean, it's just really cute i'm gonna do that so that was literally so personal i shouldn't have done that but i did it let's do what's in my bag you already know my case i don't want to use it anymore because it it looks like pee there's Hamlet. I I can't. I don't understand. I'm probably have to read it. You know, this is fun. I have these because if someone gives you these at a party, it means they want to give you a kiss. This represents a kiss. So if someone gives you this, um, you know what that means. And I always carry one because I always want a little smooch. Then we have a coin 
tiny dime. It's not mine. And my charger and my headphones. Oh my god. That was overwhelming. I'm not gonna. <laughs> but that's it. Here's my water. Last night I watched Sing 2 and I cried so much. I cried so much. I fucking hate Sing. It, why is it so epic? Like, who decided to make it so epic? And I also watched Midsummer, but I only watched. I, I got to the part when the old people jump from, jump from the cliff, and I stopped it and I went to sleep. But I'm gonna continue today. So, um, what else did I do? Nothing. So that's it. That's the update. And I hope you're doing well. And I. I really encourage you to write your own feelings or make videos because it's just, I can't bear with the thought that I'm going to forget what I'm feeling or forget how I felt in some specific moment. So it's just very special and I know that the fu my future self will want to look back. Yeah. But if you don't want to look back, just live your life and trust your brain. So that was so random. I'm really sorry. <laughs> this video is that. Um, I hope you, I hope you don't get super freaked out about what I wrote, but it is what it is. So thanks for listening and thanks for respecting my feelings. So yeah, that's it. You want a kiss? Okay, that's it guys. Um, bye and... And say happy birthday to me on March 30th. Bye.